What's going on everybody? Today we got a menu item number 10, chili and macaroni, genuine Department of Defense military MRE. Date code 2014, 279th day. Pretty fresh. And this one's interesting because the seal, instead of going straight across the bottom, it's crooked. So that's pretty neat. Anyway, the Chili Mac MRE started in 1995 as menu item number two, and then in 96 it got bumped up to menu item number 10, and remained so until 2006, if I'm not mistaken. And in 2006, it got changed to menu item number, let's see, 21. 21 for 2006 and 2007, and then in 2008, it returned to menu number 10 and has remained as such all these years. So let's go ahead and see what we got. All right, so we got a peelable seal. Let's crack that thing open. All right, see some contents there right off the bat. Okay, set that over there and zoom out. So, we've got crackers, date code on that is 2014, 266th day, not bad, not bad, not bad, flame is low, ration heat up, 2014, 227, should be pretty fresh, should work good, for only being a couple of years old, hey, I'm not complaining. Clear accessory packet. We got some napkins, moist towelette. Looks like some uh, kind of pepper there, sugar. We've got some chiclets and freeze dried coffee, sugars, things like that. We'll check that out in a little bit. Hot water bag. Gotta have one of those. Cheese spread with jalapenos. Nice and firm. Let's see. Production date, 2014, 237th day. Still feels pretty good, no delamination on the bag at all. So that should be pretty tasty. Wildberry Skittles. Now this I'm excited about. I haven't had Skittles in a long time. October 2014, 15th day. Pretty simple date code to read there. Trusty MRE spoon. And what do we get? Carbohydrate, electrolyte, beverage powder, fruit punch. Thank God it's not cocoa. I'm so tired of getting MREs with cocoa beverage powder. I'm so tired of it. I'm so excited for this. We'll check that out here in a little while. And looks like we got some sterling foods. MRE trans fat free lemon poppy seed pound cake. Now that should be pretty tasty. Pretty tasty. 2014, 262nd day. And looks like, last but certainly, definitely not least, chili and macaroni. 2014, 237th day. Looks like 1813 a time. Maybe that's a time? Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments down there. But it looks like the time of the batch code. But uh, it feels pretty stiff. I know our MRE uh, Flamish Flashing here should cook that up pretty well. And here's the chili mac macaroni and beef and sauce. Here the Chishul thinks about that. All right, so the first thing we're gonna start with is the Chili Mac. Now Chili Mac by far is my number one favorite MRE menu item. Always has been, always. Even way back in the day when I was in the service, it was like number one go-to. I would trade an entire, an entire bag of MREs just for that one. I don't care. I, just, I like it. It's my favorite. And it'll remain so. Anyway, we're going to need our main entree here. Make sure it's nice and loose there. And get some even cooking. Best we can. Slide that joker in there, like so. And we'll need some water. Luckily, I have some water ready to go. And we'll 
little filler up to the do not overfill line. And I, I usually go just a little bit over just because I know for a fact that sometimes they don't cook too good. They don't activate it for them. So move it around there so the whole thing can get nice and more moist activated. You know, I can feel it heating up already, so let's get that in there. Get it cooking. And I'll lean it against my rock or something. Like my trusty MRE spoon. While that stuff's cooking up our main entree with the FRH, let's get rid of this uh, powder and turn it into some delicious drink, huh? What do you say? Got our cup. Got our pack it open. Oh, I can already smell the fruit punch. It smells phenomenal. Yeah, that, that looks great. For two years old, that, that that's not bad at all. Let's add a... Well, it says directions for use allow water chemically purified to stand 30 minutes. Now we don't have to worry about that. 12 ounces of water, half a canteen cup. Well, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna do. I like to shoot from the hip. There we go, get it all out. Yeah, we'll set that in there. We'll just pour it on up. How about that? Oh, that smells great. Almost like, I can definitely smell watermelon in it. Smells really good. Stir that up a little bit. Smells great. Let's try it out. Mmm. Yeah, that's super fruity. I like it. I like it. Could use some ice. Wild berry Skittles. I'm just gonna, you know what? Skittles are Skittles. There's nothing like wild, wild berry Skittles. That's that's just fact. Let's get these poured out here. Yeah, those look really good. I mean, they're Skittles. Who can go wrong with Skittles? Let's see what else we got here. Oh yeah, the Sterling Foods. MRE trans fat free lemon poppy seed pound cake. Yeah, this just poppy seed pound cake. That would have been way shorter. Save some ink. Oh, there we go. Mmm. You know what? Not gonna lie. It smells like dog food. Like, it smells like, I don't know, like the inside of a cat food bag. But, mmm. It's good. A little. Takes a little bit for the um for the lemon to kick in. So at first, don't be you know it'll give you the impression of like oh it's kind of bland, bleh, you know. But no, give it a chance. It'll grow on you. It'll grow on you. All right. Let's see. Oh, of course, the crackers with the jalapeno cheese spread should be pretty good. Let's see if I can open these without brutally breaking them. Oh, 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 oh. Did they make it? Yes, they did. A oh, little crumbs, who cares, right? These are definitely, you know what? They're oily. Like, they're, like you could, like, I can, I don't know if this translates on camera, per se, but the top one has, like, this insane layer of oil on it. And as I wipe it, then the cracker takes a matte finish. But without wiping it, it has a glossy texture. I don't know if that translates, but when you wipe it, it goes away. That's, I don't know, maybe some kind of preservative. Not preserving it too well since it's making a huge mess, but let's get our cheese spread. With jalapenos. And I've had this cheese before. It's pretty tasty. Never, never, never disappoints. Get some of that on a cracker. Oh yeah. Spread it on. Ugh. Yeah. 
this I like. I like to do this. This is just me. I've never seen anybody else do this. Just more. Yeah, that's that's how I do it. That's how I get down. Mmm. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. Very satisfied with that. This cheese, I've tried to find it every, anywhere else. Anything that compares to it. And man, it's just pretty awesome. I love it. Mm. Can't find anything like it anywhere. Alright, so it's extremely hot to the touch. This FRH did not disappoint. I mean, it's it's blazing. It's, yeah, it's pretty hot. Let's see here. Oh yeah, uh, y yeah. you want to be careful with these. You don't want to get a thermal burn from the steam coming up in your face or anything like that. Or when you stick your fingers in the bag. But this one's cooled off a little bit, so it'll be okay. Alright. I'm going to put this back on our rock or something. Now, it's hot enough to get that coffee hot, so you can reuse it. I, in a sense, you know, go ahead and put it in there now and get your nice hot coffee or be a baller and throw some ice in there, you know. Who needs a fancy place for coffee when you can just get some type 3? Anyway, let's see. Oh, yeah, that's, that's nice and hot all, all the way around, all the way through. So, let's go ahead and get that spread out onto the tray. All right. Oh yeah, that, that's, oof, you can smell the chili right off the bat. That looks great. I can't wait to eat this. I haven't had this in so long. Get in my belly. <laughs> Seems like it's cooked pretty good through and through. Let's get it all out. I'm going to waste none of this holy grail here, let me tell you what. Every little bit of it. All right. Hmm. Yeah. That's pretty good. Let's see. So, looks pretty good. Looks just like I had before back in the day. That chili mac. Real nice consistency. Nice and beefy. Mm-hmm. Yep. Hmm. That's pretty awesome. You know, call me crazy. Maybe if I take some of this cracker and some of this jalapeno cheese. Just happen to add some of that. Yeah, that's happening. Hmm. Oh my god. The jalapeno in the cheese spread has the perfect amount of kick for the mac and cheese for the chili mac I mean yeah this is right on I would be completely happy having this meal in the field or camping or whatever it is you're doing this will not disappoint at all um, yeah this is this is well balanced meal you got a little bit of everything. Sweet, spicy, meaty. Yeah, this is on point. I, this does not disappoint at all. Well, folks, there you have it. The menu item number 10, chili macaroni, or chili mac. Genuine military MRE. Thanks for watching.